The National Weather Service is now confirming at least 16 tornadoes touched down in Illinois and Indiana Friday. The Apollo Theater in Belvedere was badly damaged by powerful winds as 260 people were inside for a concert. That's where we find CBS 2's Asal Rezai with the latest on cleanup efforts there. I'm told cleanup efforts here could take weeks, if not longer. You can see the changes here just over the last few days. They've put up a chain link fence around many perimeters here, multiple buildings, and you can see the Apollo there has a big pile of debris next to it. The damage widespread as powerful winds sent debris flying across this entire area. At least 40 people injured and one man, a father and grandfather, 50-year-old Frederick Livingston, was killed when the roof collapsed. Governor J.B. Pritzker was here over the weekend taking in the damage. Dozens of people from the community here also gathering for a vigil with heavy hearts for the victims and for the Apollo that they say is a huge staple here in Belvedere. At least 260 people were told were inside the theater for the concert at the time of the storm. State officials say tornado, tornado sirens rather did go off about 25 minutes before the storm hit, but there was just not enough time to get people to the basement before the impact. It happened so quickly thereafter that um, as far as I understand, no one was able to actually get to that shelter in time. Our community is heartbroken. Our thoughts and prayers continue for Fred Livingston, his families, his loved ones, and all those injured at this tragedy. An emergency proclamation has been issued by Governor J.B. Pritzker. That will help with immediate resources, not only for the Apollo Theater, but other places in Boone County and across the state impacted by the storms. Reporting in Belvedere, S.L. Rezai, CBS 2 News. That's all. Thank you.